Good morning, good morning, good morning, YouTube. Welcome back to another beautiful day with me, Justin. Turn Bingham, Landon Bingham, Ava Bingham, Ashton Bingham. Guys, we are just chilling here this morning in a beautiful Bear Lake. Guys, this place is pristine and amazing during the winter time. We're gonna give you a glimpse of this here with the drone here in a minute. But first, we thought, well, we're staying at an Airbnb. We don't have any breakfast food. Let's go get some breakfast. So we came back to a, one of only maybe three restaurants that's actually open anyway this time I think of year. Two now. Two, Summit yeah. Summit closed. Summit is closed, you're right. So anyway, we came out here to Cooper's because they only serve breakfast one day a week. Well, that happens to be today. So we're headed over to Cooper's to eat some delicious breakfast with Connor and Alexa before we head back to our uh, Airbnb and just chill for a bit. We got yeah. really no agenda, no schedule we're today. the Pro Bowl too. We got the Pro Bowl coming up, but we also want to explore kind of wintry Bear Lake. I think the kids maybe want to do a little, do we want to do sledding? Yes, yes. We don't have any sleds. Bear Lake is so cool in the winter. We don't have any sleds, we though. Should come. We're going to buy sleds. We're going to buy sleds. We have a sled. He bought his skis. He bought his uh, snowboarding sleds. I want to be out. He bought the one that you hold on and you snowboard. We have two of them, then. So, maybe get a little sledding in. We're going to go probably walk onto the frozen lake. I know you guys might be thinking, well, that's so crazy. This is very I common. Don't, People snow will be on this lake, so it's actually totally fine. I don't know if I want to do that. Well, maybe we won't. So, let's go eat at Cooper's. Woo. Just a, just a local, local turkey meetup. Oh, guys, Thanksgiving. See you soon. Oh my gosh, dude. Who wants turkey? Look how many are in here. <laughs> All right, y'all. We have made it out here, soaking up a little bit of the winter wonderland over here in Bear Lake. Ava has this snow skate that she has been dying to use this entire time we have been here. Probably on our way out, we'll probably find some bigger hills, but she wants to show off some of her mad skills over here on this snow skate. Guys, she's falling in her brother's footsteps over here. She's goofy footed, which is what I am. And that's what turbo is. And she's got, she's got the snow bug. Ava's a great skier. And I think she could probably pick up snowboarding pretty quickly too. Big legs, there you go, big arms. Oh my goodness, this is perfect. All right, should we see it? Okay, here, I gotta help you up though, end result. It's all about the end result. Let's see it here. Oh, wow. That is a snow angel, my dear. <laughs> all right, you guys, it is time to check out of this beautiful Airbnb and start heading back home, back to beautiful Utah County. We might stop along the way and check out some more winter wonderland. The kids brought the sleds. You saw Ava this morning. Kern has his little snow skate. So we might stop some hills along the way. A very casual, casual way back home is how we like to say it.
So all of you who are watching from Wisconsin will appreciate this, but my brother did not come empty handed. He knows our love of cheese in this family. And he brought us seven or eight different kinds of cheeses from Wisconsin. He also brought these Entenmann crumb donuts. These are my mom's favorite. And for some reason you can't find these on the West Coast. Yay! Donuts! Although if we're wrong and you know where to find these in Arizona, please comment down below. <laughs> in the meantime, he'll be bringing them. Mm -hmm. so we got a couple cheeses over here. We got a couple cheeses over here. Mm. Uh -huh. Cheese. And I bought some bread and some grapes yesterday, not realizing that that's not very Wisconsin at all. It's much more Italian. If this was Wisconsin, we'd have pickles, olives, summer sausage, and according to my brother, venison. Don't eat in Wisconsin. All right, you guys, as promised, we did say we would stop real quick. And this is the sledding hill they've all been dying to go on. So oh a my, few. It's so like, <laughs> it's so long. A, a, a few are gonna venture out here into the cold. Others of us might stay here in the warmth of the vehicle, but we're gonna check out this winter wonderland one last time before we head back home. All right, you going, Tur? <laughs> okay, Ava, show us how to do it, girl. Ready? Yeah, turns going fast. Okay, go, Ava. <laughs> Are you okay? Ava, go get it! All the way, dude, all the way. Bend your knees. Oh, Peanut, come on up here, try it. Oh, bend your knees. Bend <laughs> oh, he's going so Hang on, Ash. <laughs> he won't stop. Hang on, <laughs> You can't, he went so far out of you. Okay, Ava, you go real quick. She's spinning around in circles. <laughs> Ava, are you okay? Okay. Guys, something Landon has always wanted to do. Now is the greatest time because he is not feeling like jumping on one of these sleds. He's always wanted to fly the drone. So you're about to see exclusive drone footage from Landon Bingham himself. Are you ready, buddy? Yeah. All right, let's go fly. Okay. All right, guys, so Landon <laughs> saw how much fun these guys are having. Says, nope, I'm going next. So Turn has suited him up, slid a helmet on him real quick, actually. And we're gonna let him whip down this hill real fast. Now, Landon, if you get nervous, just fall off. <laughs> Listen to him giggle. <laughs> yeah, Lando! What? Your legs hurt. Your legs hurt? Okay, keep coming. All right, so back in the car, now finally headed back down through Logan Canyon. Quick consensus here, Ava, Turn, Ashland, was that worth it? Definitely. Yes? yes? Guys, we may have found our new favorite sledding hill. The problem is it just has to be two hours away from our house. <laughs>
guys. Look who's here. I told you that my brother is coming to visit Arizona. And I don't think you've ever been on my vlog before. Sure haven't. No one has met my brother. This is my brother, David. And as you can see, when my <laughs> when you see how tall all my kids are, you'll see it's not just from the Bingham side. My brother is 6'4". So we've got height on both sides, but I'm so happy that he's here. I told you I don't ever get to see my brother. We don't see each other very often. Mm -hmm. So it's so fun that we're both here with my parents. He's actually just cooking up some steaks over here for us. He's the master griller. My dad lets you do something. You must be good at it because he didn't ask me to make anything while I was here. <laughs> all right, you guys, we have made it back home. So funny story. I didn't even video last like five hours. So as you saw, we went sledding. We had a blast. As we're going back down, we decided to stop, get a little quick bite to eat. My cousin JC FaceTimes me and I said, oh my gosh, dude, I didn't want to bug you. I just assumed you had family over. It was your birthday. I said, hey, we're just eating and we're heading out of town. He's like, no, you get your butt up here right now. My aunt was there. Anyway, so he convinces me to go up there. So glad that we actually went up there though, because when I got there, I had all of my cousins there that I had not seen in a really long time. I had my cousin Julie, my cousin Becca. I had my aunt Sandy up there, my cousin JC, all of their kids. It was so fun for my kids to get to hang out with second generation cousins here and just have an absolute blast. It just brought back so many wonderful memories of Hunsaker family gatherings and things like that. It, it was just a blast. We hung out at his house for a bit, had an amazing dinner, an amazing dessert. We waxed my skin. I tell you what, if you need anything in the outdoors, JC Bush is your man to go to. But guys, had so much fun this weekend. We just pulled into the house, time to put the kids in bed. Lindsay comes back tomorrow. What a wonderful weekend spending time with family. Honestly, I just thought of my dad so much this weekend as I was with family because we did a lot of things that he just loves to do. And I just know he certainly was smiling down looking at these family gatherings that we were having. And watching my kids interact with my cousin's kids was just something special. It really was. So anyway, guys, thanks for hanging out with us. It's been a pleasure playing Mr. Mom for the last a little bit. We've got one more day. Lindsay really gets in tomorrow evening. So we really got one more day of kind of running around a little, a little crazy. And then the CEO of the household comes back. So thanks for hanging out, you guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Take care.